breaking news. Reporting live from High School Baptist Church, where good news equals changed lives. Early Sunday morning, several women went to Jesus' grave with burial spices. They were going to care for his dead body, or so they thought. Luke 24, 2 and 3 says this, The women found an open tomb, but no body in sight. They were confused until they saw two angels standing nearby. The angel said, Why are you looking for the living among the dead? And reminded them how Jesus said he would be crucified and would rise again on the third day. The women remembered and they ran to tell Jesus' closest disciples that he had risen from the dead. Jesus walked the earth for 40 days after his resurrection and many people saw him. Jesus then told his disciples to take this good news about his death and his resurrection to their families, their neighbors, and everyone that they met. Tanya, so why did Jesus have to die on the cross? You see, our sins, they separate us from God, but God loves us so much and has provided a way across that separation. How could a person be changed by this good news? Jeannie, it's as easy as A, B, C. First, admit to God that you are a sinner. All of us are sinners. We all do wrong things, and we cannot get to heaven by just trying to be good. B, we all we have to believe that Jesus is God's only Son, and that He died on a cross to take the punishment for our sin. And C, we have to confess that Jesus is Lord and believe that Jesus is God's Son, and that He took the punishment for our sin. That is simple. So, good, good news. news equals changed lives.